All right, hey everybody, this is Chris with Performance Bike. I'm here with Jeremiah Bishop at the Jeremiah Bishop Graham Fondo. Uh, Jeremiah, tell us uh, just real briefly about the day and uh, uh, how, how do you feel about the event? Well, I think it went fantastic. Uh, couldn't have asked for a better turnout, and we've got a bunch of people from all over the East Coast. Part of this riders were from California, and um, people are ringing the bell as they cross the line. We've got a little pop and circumstance, a little alpine flavor here with our international flags, our European ride snacks, and, and we're hoping to do something a little bit different here, and I think we've succeeded. What do you think? Yeah, oh yeah, it was a great event. And uh, so this is your legs hurt? Is oh, it, is my it a big question? Fine. That's what I want to know. I could have done another 10 miles. He said I should make, he said he thinks I should make it harder. I think oh, no. if you talk to most of the people, <laughs> I talked to the, the guy who won the first KOM, uh, my buddy Keck Baker, best all-around rider in Virginia, I came up to him and I said, hey, do you want to go up the extra piece up the Reddish Knob? No, I'm good, man. It's cool. <laughs> that was his quote, so I was, I was really pleased. It crushed Keck the Butcher Baker, and um, you know my legs are trash, so I know a lot of people are really stoked to, to finish, and you know, the finisher's medals here mean something. You know, they're definitely some uh, easier events out there, but this is not one of those. This is really an accomplishment, and, and we've had some glowing praise, and and I think the best praise is from the people who didn't finish. They're like, man, I am coming back. I am coming back to get this thing. And they're fired up on it, and that's what we want. You know, we want some energy, and we want a different event, and you know, I think we really succeeded with uh, you know, the charity fundraising. We raised almost five thousand dollars in the first year, so I think we'll double this thing next year without too much trouble. That was his leader's jersey. Yeah, attract more people to, to come check it out. It's uh, really the bike capital of Virginia, and the mountains. The mountains are mean. Oh yes. Well, next year I'll be, you know, content to just cruise and. But, you know, I was thinking about the stage race. I'm going to be hurt. 28,000 feet of climbing. Everybody wonders why there's a lion on the front of this jersey. It's because you will feel like you conquered a lion with your bare hands if you finish this race, you know, in, in any respectable time. And, you know, that's uh, we'll something to look forward to. I'm pumped on it, and the Alpine Loop hopefully will be good training. I'm going to have to get off my feet in the next 48 hours to, to make it happen. But... You know. Well, good luck. Yeah. And uh, thanks very much for your we'll time. We'll get fired up on it. Yeah. And, thanks uh, so much. Good luck with Pisca and uh, good luck with the Olympics next year. Great. Thank you. Thanks for coming, guys. Thank you.